All right, first of all, I'd like to thank you all for coming. It's 7.15, you're 15 minutes late. You know, I know it would be easier for us to show up to work every morning if we didn't go to the crazy horse every night. But then what would be the purpose of living? I rock. It looks like none of you are hungover or strung out and you're all under 26. I'm glad you're making good choices. I guess you can make up for it when you're 40. I mean, come on, Frankie, do we not know how to have fun? My father had three kids by the time he was 26. Rocco's got Amber, Crystal, and Tiffany to support. What sounds more fun? Colin, yes, I know your mother is a boomer, but it's still not nice to call her a sociopath just because she failed to save for her retirement by spending all of her money on new cars and private schools for you. Wait, Ma, why are you crying? Who called you fat? The doctor? You mean the doctor with the black eye? No, Ma, I know he don't have a black eye right now. Okay? You feel better. So, Alex, with two X's, you're saying that America doesn't do enough for you. Even though we pay for your health care, your 401k, your company car, your kale salads, and your free charging station for your Nissan Leaf, you still believe that Denmark would treat you better. This is the greatest country in the world. Right, right. Where would you rather live? You want to go to Italy? You don't have to leave the U.S. We got your little Italy right here. Caleb, our new laborer, Juan Carlos, would like you to replace the American flag that you ripped off his truck. His brother is still waiting to get into the country and wanted to know if you'd like to trade places with him. Rocco, we're going to need three flags. One for the office, one for the crane, and one for the pole at the American Dream Room in the Crazy Horse. Amber's going to hang it with her feet. Michael, he said act like a man because he saw you applying hand lotion after you took off your gloves. I know it says it's made for men. That's the problem. Right, are you gonna start acting like a man or are you gonna keep talking about when Harry met Sally? How about when my foot meets your ass? You need to watch your godfather again. Jonathan, I know it's very upsetting to find out there is no such thing as a left-handed screwdriver. Or is there? Let's talk about it later, after you get the board stretcher. Look, Sal, I know it's tough to find out that this girl you've been engaged to for the last three years isn't 100% Italian. But you know the rules, Sal. You want to make grandma cry? Staring at a Hooters waitress does not make Michael a creepy boomer. He's only 25. It makes him a reformed millennial. Bobby, if you date a girl named Glory Candy and introduce her to Rocco, what the fuck did you think was going to happen? He's going to use his pip talk, steal her away, and then you're going to be left alone squeezing your monkey. Alex, I know it's perfectly acceptable to tell everyone about your anxiety disorder, but it's also perfectly acceptable to hide it. What do you mean you're nervous about putting it up your nose, Frankie? Huh? It's 100% pure. It's not woo-woo, it's Cocoa Puff. Take a chance. Caleb, I would agree with you that Colin isn't doing his fair share of work to make the project fail, but he says he is. I would call that gaslighting, but I don't know what I'm talking about. Rocco, make sure when we finish that brick wall, Ronnie don't get a dime. Oh, you worked on it, Roddy? What am I supposed to do? Believe you or my eyes? What the fuck? You think I'm nuts, Ron? Jonathan, I know your new company shirt doesn't fit right and it says Domino's, but it's repurposed clothing, just like you asked for. What is that, your sister's shirt, Ronnie? You going to a Boy George concert? We wear black, Ronnie. You got to pick today to be flamboyant? How the fuck are we going to work with the Manfredi crew? I don't need Paul Manfredi busting my balls all day. Oh, who's the chick with the golden yellow shirt, huh? What is he trying to do? Express himself. Damn, I miss the 80s. Holiday, celebrate. Get the fuck out of here, Ronnie. At least she's Italian though, right, Sal? So.